According to Mark, our stats guy, a 0% chance of rain today. McAllister will watch that one go into the end zone. And Jay, you heard from Libby there that Hassan Clue will make the start for the 49ers. Winning drive touchdowns in three of their last four games. Here's Clue. He's going to look to throw near side. He's got Warpay Kofa open. That's going to be a first down and across the 40-yard line. So two seniors in their final home game connect for a first down. They'll give it back. Benny LeMay, big hole up the middle. He's got the first down and more. Benny to the 40, inside the 35, and dragged out of bounds. And a flag thrown down on the tackle. They're going to mark him out. It looks like the 28 and probably tack on another 15. High snap, gets it down. It's another handoff. Benny LeMay up the middle, and Benny's into the end zone. Touchdown to Charlotte. LeMay from nine yards out. And Jay, they made that look pretty easy. Uh, that was a statement drive, and Charlotte just physically imposing their will. And it's just great to see Anthony Jones back on the field. Get into that story as we go. Here's Morgan looking to throw on first down. Goes over the middle of the field. He's got a man wide open. Palmer with the catch. So far, three plays all in the air by the Panthers. They'll bring Alexander in motion. It's a handoff to Jones trying to go to the outside. He's going to get the first down and more inside the 40. Down to the 36-yard line, Anthony Jones for the FIU family. And to see Jones back out there starting this game, something cool to see. Here's a quick screen pass to Alexander. Inside the 30, down to the 26. 35 points or more in three of their last four games. Quick throw to the outside, going to be caught by Singleton. And he makes one man miss, going to get inside the 15-yard line. Another first down for FIU. Down and five, tenth play of the drive for the Panthers. Morgan going to look to throw. Got some time, fires to the end zone, and it's incomplete. Like Ed Roll hitting Alexander. 13 on the season. 25-yard snap was a little low. The hold is there, though. The kick is up, and the kick is good. LeMay, the running back in the pistol formation behind Clue. They'll give it to Benny. He's got a huge hole. Benny LeMay to the 35-yard line. Got a first down and more. Almost thought Jay could have gotten more than the 15. It looked like one of his own teammates, I think, kind of got in his way for a second. The running back split to the right of Hassan Clue. And it's going to be a quarterback draw. Clue going to try to get to the outside. He's going to pick up the first down and more. Hassan Clue into Panther territory on a beautifully dialed up play by Shane Montgomery. Second and six. Panthers showing blitz. They'll bring it. It's a handoff. I shot finger. He's met at the line of scrimmage. Ball came out at the end. It's picked up by the Panthers. It's Sage Lewis going the other way. Clue trying to track him down. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, Sage Lewis. Takes it the distance. Oh, I shot not putting any uh, weight, I believe, on his left leg. Sage Lewis is back out there. Throw from a clue caught by Work Pay Kofa. And that's a first down out to the 29 yard line. Here's another handoff. Benny LeMay coming near side. Benny again with a lot of running room. And he gets, looks like a first down out to the 30 yard line. Here's another handoff. This is going up the middle. Aaron McAllister. McAllister breaks free to the 50. Still on his feet inside the 40. Aaron McAllister to the 37 yard line under center. Good pressure right up the middle. They grab Benny LeMay and they drop him. Richard Dames, the sophomore. Three tight ends all move over to the right side. It's a pitch. It's Benny LeMay going up the middle. He's not going to get it. The Panthers had it red. Sage Lewis helping in on the stop. Freeman also there on the stop. The Texas transfer. Here's Morgan going to look to throw. He wants to go deep down the field. And this ball is going to be caught. And a flag is going to be thrown on DJ Anderson for pass interference. But Maloney with the catch down at about the 29-yard line. For the season-ending injury in that game. Clue here looking to throw on first down. He's got a man wide open deep. It's Victor Tucker behind the defense. Tucker, he's got it. He's in the 20 to the 10 and inside the 10-yard line. Victor Tucker, I looked up, Jay, as Clue was looking to throw, and I saw nobody picked up Victor Tucker. May is going to go in motion. Clue going to run it himself. 
Clue to the goal line, and he's stuffed short. Clue goes under center, fourth and goal from the one. It's a pitch to LeMay. LeMay dives for the end zone. He's in. Touchdown, 49ers. Benny LeMay from one yard out, his second of the game, and we're an extra point away from Charlotte. Night for Atlantic. Suffered another loss, losing to North Texas on the road, 41-38. First down pass caught to the outside by Singleton. That's going to be an easy first down across the 40. Bryce Singleton coming in today, 23 catches, 288 yards. Thing up there, presenting a nice target and completing the pass. Morgan looking to throw, he's got time. He's got another completion. This one into 49er territory across the 45-yard line. 49ers will bring just three. The throw to the outside, too high for Thornton, and it falls incomplete. We will go play action. Got some time, flushed out to the far side. Now we'll just tuck it and duck out of bounds well short of the first down. So the Panther defense going to force a three and out. 15 on the play clock, still plenty of time for Morgan. Play action with Maxwell, look to throw over the middle of the field. That ball is going to be caught by Wharton. And this will be a first down inside the 45. Dad played at Florida State. Drafted and played a few years in the NFL with Washington. A little handoff, Maxwell, he's on his feet to the corner. He's to the 20, to the 10. Maxwell, touchdown, FIU. 39 yards, Napoleon Maxwell. So each team with two here. Morgan going to look to throw near side of the field. That ball going to be caught by Thornton. That's a first down across the 50. Slide down to the 47. Clock will stop as they move the chains. He's got Maxwell out on the flat. Finally throws it to him, but he had to fall down to make the catch. Jawan Foggy was there. But if that throws more on the money, Jay, that's probably a first down and more. Run the ball, but that was such a huge, pivotal job by that defense getting off the field, not giving the offense of FIU any momentum. And they go back to LeMay, picks up the first down. Seen Clue on a draw a couple times today. They'll hand it off Benny LeMay, coming near side. He's going to get the first down, did not get out of bounds. Dante Price, he is the running back to the right of Morgan. Morgan will look to throw. Quick pass to the outside, caught by Maloney. And that's going to be a first down and more. He's in the 50, still on his feet, and dragged down out of bounds inside the 40 yard, 40 yard line. Austin Maloney, what speed after the catch. As they bring Alexander in motion, they're going to swing it to him. We'll see if he throws it. He's got a man wide open. That's Thornton at the 10 yard line, makes the catch. And down to the six, you can see that one developing. Alexander, again, a guy who's played 16 games. Trip in the red zone. They've had to settle for field goals the first two times. They've gotten down here quickly. A little shovel pass. Going to be caught and into the end zone. Touchdown, Anthony Jones from six yards out. And what a statement opening drive. As FIU has scored the last two touchdowns. Hand off, Benny LeMay, not going to happen. FIU's defensive line stood him right up at the line of scrimmage. Anthony Johnson on the stop, the redshirt senior. Can't do it here, the situation in the ball game. Here's Corbett again, booms this punt. Alexander back at his own 15-yard line. Got some room up the middle. Get across the 35. And Alexander still going, a flag was thrown. I thought he was down. Panthers here at first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Ball dumped off over the middle to Alexander across the 30, right near the first down marker. Looked like he picked it up. This game about 50% on thirds down, just one out of five in the game. 49ers will bring some pressure. They're going to throw deep for Maloney behind his man, but he can't make the catch. Oh, the pass looked like a little bit underthrown. Going to fake the handoff, going to look the throw. He's got Benny LeMay down the field, and Benny makes the catch at the 35. Steps out of bounds at the 37-yard line. Going with the two running backs, LeMay and McAllister. This time they give it to Benny LeMay. He's got some room here to the near side of the field, across the 50. Two downs to pick up these three yards. There's a handoff, Benny LeMay going up the middle. He's got the first down to the 
30-yard line. LeMay going up the middle. FIU quickly scored on their opening drive of this quarter. Clue going to look to throw. He's got time. Going to go down the field looking for Victor Tucker. Diving, and he made the catch at the one-yard line. What a catch by the redshirt freshman. Play by the wide receiver. 49ers hurry to the line. Handoff. Benny LeMay for the third time today. LeMay is into the end zone. And the 49ers have cut the lead to seven. And that was a huge drive by the 49ers just to get it back between one possession ball game. The all-time series, three to none. The handoff, this is Price. Get across the 30-yard line, so a six-yard pickup on first down. Earned three, they need the 35 for a first down. 49ers showing blitz. They'll only bring three. Throw to the outside, that's caught, that's a first down. And a big one for FIU out to the 36 yard line. Morgan gonna look to throw. As all day, comes here near side of the field, a sliding catch gonna be made by Thornton. And that's a first down out to the 49 yard line. Panthers here at their own 49 yard line. Jones still the running back. He'll get the carry. And he's able to bounce off a tackle to the outside. He's got a blocker in front of him. Jones to the 30. He's to the 20. Jawan Foggy will drag him down. Inside the 15-yard line of the 13. FIU into the final minute of the third quarter. 6-0 and when leading heading to the fourth. It's a handoff price. And he's thrown down by DeLuca. But the way DeLuca threw him down will actually give him a first down, it looks like. Jones the running back. They bring Alexander in motion. Jones wide open. Touchdown, FIU, his second receiving touchdown. And that was drawn up beautifully, Jay. A great design. They send Jones in motion this time. Now the throw into the end zone. It's there, and it's caught. Gaither on the reception. They'll send Warpe in motion. It's a handoff to Callister. And McAllister still on his feet across the 35-yard line, hit high. It looked clean, though. There's three out of eight on third downs in the game. Facing a third and five. Clue. Going to tuck it. He should be able to pick up the first down on the ground. He will right up to midfield. They control their own destiny to do that and face UAB. Here's Clue going to look to throw. A blatant hold. Phillips makes the catch. Finally, the flag comes in way late. Blue's got time, and now he'll tuck it and he'll run. He'll get to the 25, and inside the 25, looked like a first down for Hassan Clue. Niners in the red zone, three out of four in the red zone today. It's a handoff, LeMay coming near side of the field, gets the corner, and it was right near the 10-yard line he stepped out, and that is where he steps out. That'll make it first and goal for the 49ers. Hand it off again, Benny LeMay up the middle and for the fourth time today, the redshirt junior, Benny LeMay. And they had a 39 yard touchdown run from Napoleon Maxwell to put him up 20 to 14. Here's the throw to the near side, Maloney on the reception and he's gonna get the first down, nice move to get away from the first defender. They'll hand it off Maxwell, he's got some room to the outside. Maxwell still on his feet. Down to the 30, to the 20, Maxwell's gone. Touchdown, FIU second time today. Napoleon Maxwell has gotten to the outside and taken it the distance. We'll clinch its spot in the conference championship game. Here's Clue facing some pressure and he's thrown down. Dier Tart, his fourth sack of the season. And he busted up that play right off the bat. Clue facing pressure, that's gonna be a hold. Clue gonna try to run it himself. He'll go for it, I think that was Tart again who just flew off the ball, Jay, and drew the hold. Clue's got time, that ball gonna be caught. Tyler Ringwood on the reception, just his second catch of the year. 49ers down 14 late, trips to the left for Clue. Pressure comes up the middle, Clue will dump it off, Benny LeMay makes the catch. Not much on the play, out to the 38-yard line. Rush four, bring guy, trusting his defensive line can get to Clue. Here's Clue, pump fake. Now he's gonna look to run. Clue's gonna get the first down up near midfield. 
And right at the 50, Hassan Clue, three to go. Clue. Look to try to run again. Not going to happen that time. Panthers drop them behind the line back at the 46-yard line. Clue. He's got time. Fires. That ball going to be caught. Warpe Kofa, first down inside the 35 to the 32. 15 yards passing, 12 of 17 in the game. He'll look to throw again, and he's going to be dropped. It's Kevin Oliver. With Freeman leading the way with 13 tackles for FIU. Here's Clue to throw over the middle of the field. That ball going to be caught. R.J. Tyler made the reception short of the first down, so it's now a fourth down. Clue takes the snap. Facing pressure. Stays on his feet. Clue's going to get the first down. Just inside the 20. Pressure coming up the middle. Clue able to avoid the sack. Now he'll fire into the back of the end zone. He's got his man. Touchdown. Phillips, the tight end. Off the 27, they need the 24 for a first down. They hand it off to Maxwell. 49ers are going to meet him behind the line and drop him. Clock will run. There is 15 seconds. There's the snap. He'll punt it right away. It's high. It's short. Clock running. And FIU will down it down at the one-yard line. So eight seconds to go. 49ers got four wide receivers. Clue going to throw a quick, and it will be a quick out. Rico Arnold makes the catch, gets out of bounds. Four seconds to go. Clue going to roll out here to the near side of the field. And now he's just going to air one up towards Rico Arnold. A chance to be picked off. It is going to be, is it caught or intercepted? Either way, the game is over. And I think it's going to be an interception. 